Catholic bishops walking in the Niger Delta, often reach the enriched Niger Delta Creeks, and they say the heavy polluted waters of the region are further burdened by toxic waste from activities of local artisans whose less effective methods of processing food oil need a volume of unrefined waste dumped in the environment. All these, the stakeholders say, have continued to threaten the ecosystem as well as widespread of present and future generations in the Niger Delta and beyond. We reach places where the government agency is not rich. They should be able to put their heads together and uh, let us know, and that's what they have been doing. Although oil spillings are not limited to Nigerian oil industry alone, the round table decried frequency and occurrence. Who in the international community are buying this stolen crude? We can make money, we can buy a new car, but at the end of the day, if your environment is destroyed, your future is destroyed. Experts at the round table are unanimous that illegal refining, oil spills, and crude oil theft, if not checked, will endanger the economy, the Niger Delta region, and Nigeria at large. I'm Alija Lydia Sala, NTA News.